The Do It Yourself Science Project allows you to see and hear your voice at the same time. So, of course, leave it to Steve Spangler to make it all happen. This is today's Science Minute. Imagine if you could hear and see your voice at the same time. It can happen because your voice is just a vibration of molecules that ultimately hit your eardrum. So we're going to engineer that backwards and see if you can visualize your voice. It's a DIY project for sure, do it yourself. I have a meter stick and to that we hooked a plastic jar. You'll see that this jar we cut the end out. I'm going to speak into this end and vibrate this rubber membrane here. Now this is a big balloon, you could use a latex glove, but we're going to vibrate this so it vibrates and it's going to move this little piece of mirror that you see here. That's important because if you follow the meter stick up, I've got a laser pointer up here. Why not? So we're going to bounce the laser pointer off of that mirror. <gasps> Look at that. You see how it goes to the ceiling up here? Good. And now if I speak into this end here, we now don't have to put it on the ceiling. We can put it on the wall over here. So let me clamp this on. And so now watch what happens. See the laser over here? So now watch. Look at the patterns. One, two, three, four, five. Channel nine, nine, one. One, two, three, four. How annoying is this? See, you don't have to do it on your wall. You can do it on your neighbor's wall. That's a pretty good idea as well. Look at the vibration and the patterns. As everybody speaks, you'll get a, a different kind of pattern. I'm Steve Spangler, and that's your Laser Science Minute. Ooh, ooh. <laughs> he makes everything just seem way more fun than it is, I feel like. Yeah. <laughs> I love how we figured out, too, this could really be annoying if you're the right person for the job here. Uh, annoying your neighbors, Steve. Mm -hmm.